Hey everybody, welcome back to the CEO Life today. My name is Wes Biko, as usual. I'm here again with Shiloh Victoria and we're doing a kind of blind smell off here. So we're getting Shiloh to smell what are, I would consider five great men's fragrances, kind of the top five right now. We got Herod from Parfums de Marly. We got Creed Aventus, Crypto Mint. We got Noir Anthracite from Tom Ford and Creed Viking. So five pretty popular fragrances now. So we're, we're gonna start off here with Herod. And just give us your honest opinion on that. Oh, you smell some pepper in there. Yeah. Yeah, I quite like it. It's got that pepper. It's a fresher scent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it does have a hint of tobacco in it. Do you think it's a sexy scent? Do you think it's more of like a businessy scent or mm. casual? I'd say maybe casual, actually. This isn't something I would expect somebody in a, in a, you know, an office building downtown to wear. And it doesn't seem like something you'd wear out for the night. Um, it's not bad. It's not bad. If you had to rate it out of 10, what would you give it? Um, hmm. It's not, you know, it's not too bad. But it's not my favorite, yeah. actually. Um, five. Five. Because it's it's like it's not a bad scent, yeah. in my opinion. Mm -hmm. I mean, this is just what I'm smelling. Yeah. But it's not something that I'm like, oh my <laughs> gosh, like that is amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Excellent. So five out of ten for Herod. Next up, Crypto Mint by Thierry Mugler. I love this stuff. I like how this one is quite unique. Like, I don't feel like I've ever smelled this before. Yeah. And that's one thing I do like about it. It does seem to be kind of a unisex scent. Mm. I, I actually, it's not bad. Yeah. What would you give it out of 10? Mm. You know, mm. a seven, seven, maybe a seven. Yeah, it's, I like that it's very different. It's very unique. Yeah. I think this is something that would grow on me mm -hmm. uh, more and more if I smelt it more often. It's quite pleasant. Yeah. But it's not, once again, I find it more unisex. It's not a masculine scent that uh, somebody walks by and I'm like, mm -hmm. oh my gosh. Yeah. You know, like it's, it's pleasant though. Yeah. Quite pleasant. Excellent. Next up, Creed Aventus. This is the King of Kings. We'll see what you think of this. It's okay. It's not... Not your favorite? No. Do you feel it's a little harsh or... To be honest, it just... It doesn't stand out to me, really. Mm -hmm. It just... I feel like I've smelled this before many times and like, it just like... Just like... Cologne. It's not... Mm -hmm. It's not anything that's different in my opinion. Like, I feel like I've smelled this yeah. forever. And if you had to rate that out of 10, what would that be? Um, six. Six. Now let's say you found out your boyfriend bought this. It's $400 a bottle. <laughs> would you be mad at him? No, but. Do you think it's worth the money though? Well, you know, it changes on everybody's pheromones. Yeah. Uh, so depending on how it smelt on him, it might make it better. It might make it worse. Yeah. It's like, it's not something that I'm like, oh my gosh, that's disgusting. Mm -hmm. Because if it was, I'd be like, okay, I'm sorry, but you know, please yeah. don't wear this. <laughs> Even if it costed you $400. Yeah. And then I'd be like, why aren't you buying my clone? Mm -hmm. Right? Of I course. could charge you $400. You could. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> but it's, yeah, it's, it's okay. Excellent. All right, next on our list, Tom Ford Noir Anthracite. This is a new release. I like this stuff. Let's see what Shiloh thinks. Yeah. <laughs> no. What does it remind you of? Like somebody just smoked a cigarette? Mm. 
Yeah. Ugh. So not like sexy, not attractive at all. Don't want to smell it on a guy. No, just go buy a pack of cigarettes and smoke them. Sorry, that's a little harsh, but <laughs> I get a little passionate when yeah. it comes to scent. And out of 10, what would you give it? And then I can't stop smelling it. I don't know why. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh. 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 You know, it's not the worst thing I've smelt. Um, but definitely, you know, I, yeah, I don't know. Two. Two? Yeah. I, but that's my yeah. opinion. I just really don't like that scent, mm -hmm. personally. Nothing against the cologne. Yeah. It's just my opinion. <laughs> That's fair. Next up, Creed Viking. Let's we'll see what she thinks of this one. Oh my gosh. That I love. Yeah. That is... That's a 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. That is just... Like, sexy... Strong... <laughs> sophisticated... Like successful man scent like oh my gosh i love that <laughs> i could just smell this yeah. all day long what season do you think that's best for spring any day any day any morning any night yeah. any season i'd love to smell this on any man at any time mainly my man though yeah <laughs> <laughs> that's amazing it's excellent that i, I love yeah. that musk i love how they mixed it like there's multiple <laughs> like notes here it's not just straight musk yeah. Um, you know, it, it's well-rounded in my opinion <laughs> and I just, oh, I love it. I love it. When this first came out, people were worried that <sighs> because it has peppermint in it, they thought yeah. it would be kind of like toothpaste-y. Do you get a toothpaste vibe at all? Not at all. No, I, I love how it, I love how it has that depth, but then yeah. it has that, you know, that freshness to it, mm -hmm. but it's not overpowering. So it's not just straight peppermint. Yeah. If the peppermint was stronger in here... I may not like it as much, but it's well balanced. Yeah. So I like how it has the musk with the freshness to it as well. I love it. It's so really good. Like it. So good. Mmm. Excellent. And I also like the uh, Paco Rabanne. Paco Rabanne, yeah. Yeah, I like one that one. Yeah. yeah, that one's good. It's like it has, it's got the depth, but then it has the fresh oranges and the fresh apples, apples in it. Yeah. And it's, it just, I love how it messes with your mind a little bit. <laughs> Um, I really like that. Yeah. So there you have it, guys. She doesn't like Vic or uh, doesn't like Aventus. Loves Viking. <laughs> Big surprise, but. So yeah, if you guys want to go impress girls, if you want to smell sexy, if you want to smell like a man. Yeah. <laughs> go get Creed Viking. Yes. So thank you very much, Shiloh, and uh, here we go. Thank you.